Okay there, this is a tutorial video, my first one, on how to um, how to use GTK Record My Desktop, which is a program, application program, whatever you want to call it, to uh, it's in Ubuntu to record your desktop. Okay, so you can go, first off, the easiest way is go into Add or Remove Programs. That was in Applications, Add or Remove. And you type GTK record my desktop. And there it is. Check that little box where my mouse is and hit apply changes. That's the first way. The other way is go into system administration, synaptic package manager, enter your password. and uh, type the same thing in the search box up above GTK record my oops it's capital M my desktop and there it is right click on that mark for installation mine says mark for reinstallation because it's already installed but once you do that uh, you can hit apply up here and that'll make it install and the third way you can get it is to go into the terminal and type sudo apt install gtk dash cord my desktop. Make sure you put capital M for my desktop. And it'll ask for a password. Do that again. Enter. It says I already have the newest version, and I'm using it too. So, and that's fine. And the other thing you're going to have to do is um, to get the sound to work in it with your microphone or your webcam or whatever it is you're using to record your voice. Um, you're going to have to go into the terminal again and type these commands: ls space forward slash p r o c forward slash a sound hit enter it tells me that card one is intel oss and so intel is my uh, onboard sound i don't have a sound card um, and, and then you want to type ls space dash l a space forward slash P R O C forward slash a sound. Hit that. There you go. So it tells me more information about my onboard sound. Card zero, card one. Um, and then you type ls space forward slash P R O C. Uh, forward slash a send forward slash intel forward slash pcm zero c oops <laughs> I typed in the command wrong ls space forward slash p r o c forward slash a sound forward slash intel forward slash pcm zero c there we go and it gives you a little more information sub zero sub one sub two and then you type in cat PRC, I guess that means process. And then A sound forward slash Intel with a capital I PCM zero C forward slash info. There you go. 
But basically, what all this amounts to is that when I want to open up GTK record my desktop and change the sound settings, go to advanced sound, you have to type in your hardware and tell the tell the operating system to use your sound card. Uh, I typed in HW colon zero uh, comma zero and that worked for me. But it might not work for yours. Yours would be one or zero usually. And that's my video. So hopefully that helps you get record my desktop going and you can record your own videos and teach other people and pass on the info.